These signs and wide open beaches means it's winter time in Myrtle Beach. Some businesses actually close down and use that time to reinvest in their property to upgrade and enhance their facilities. Some just take time off and others try to struggle through the winter months in hopes that the spring comes and brings them out of that slower season. Though many small businesses close their doors for roughly six weeks, the Myrtle Beach Area Chamber of Commerce is hard at work finding ways to lure in people during the holiday season. Indoor amusements and attractions, museums, as well as events where people can attend either indoor or outdoor. With various indoor options, some people like Wanda Oakley prefer to visit the Grand Strand during the winter months. So we enjoy the quiet. We can just open the doors and listen to the ocean and there's not any music or people screaming. <laughs> it's just calm ocean waves. Plus some additional perks for holiday visitors. The rates uh, for hotels this time of year uh, can be as much as 70 to 80 percent off of what you would pay during peak season. Kelvin Chu, who's a waiter at Mrs. Fish, says they used to close for six weeks, but now they don't think it's a smart business decision. We got more people now, I think, during the winter time, a lot of more snowbirds and stuff and those kind of people coming in. So we just stay open and see what's going on.